Police open fire on a suspect in Midtown Miami. Let's get to it here. CBS 4's Trish Kristeka. She's there with the latest. And Trish, you just spoke with the cops. What did they tell you? Yeah, good morning, you guys. I just spoke with police, and they told me they were forced to shoot because a man is barricaded inside the building behind me. Take a look. It is the one right adjacent to us with the red lights on top. Now, that man is still inside barricaded. Police tell me that just before 3 a.m., they were called to this location on the 3400 block of Northeast 34th Street in regards to a suspicious person in the lobby with a firearm. Now, when Miami police arrived, they attempted to make contact with that male suspect. When they confronted him, the suspect was still armed at that time, and those two officers were forced to shoot the suspect. Then he barricaded himself, and he is still currently barricaded inside this building right now. There are multiple agencies here, including K-9, SWAT, trying to assist in this. Now, they are, the chief is expected to speak later this morning. Right now, that man is still barricaded inside, so we can't give more information than that. Now, since this is a shooting involving police officers, the Florida Department of Law Enforcement is taking is taking this over. Like we just mentioned, there are multiple agencies here or multiple departments here within Miami police that are helping assist to this. As you can see behind me, there are multiple Miami police vehicles in that back corner right underneath, uh, or right above that Chase Bank is the building this is happening in. You can see SWAT members going inside and again going in and out all morning, trying to, I guess, work with them and figure out what is going on to try and bring this man who's barricaded in there out safely. Everyone has been evacuated on that floor, which is what police tell us. So we are hoping that everyone in that area is safe as well. So if you're trying to get here, if you live in this area, that is blocked off. Now, again, police were forced to shoot at the man who was barricaded still inside. That is all the information we have right now. We are hoping to speak with the chief later in the morning to try and get more information as this unfolds. For now, we are live in Midtown. I'm Trish Kosek at CBS 4 this morning.